It was the hottest day of the summer. It was hot enough to fry an egg on the street. I went over to Daisy's because I lacked anything better to do since I'm just a vehicle to prepare the story. Yay! What a surprise! How you been? I'm um, Excellent, excellent. Um, come on, come on. Daisy and uh, your queer friend and I, we've been trying to escape this searing heat. Oh, hi, Nick. Horrible heat we're having, aren't we? Drinks over here. I'm dying. Why, hello there, old sport. Oh, Gatsby, you're so cool. Hey, wait a second. Norton, something's not quite right here. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. We're going to go to town. But oh, shut up, Willie. Really. Get in the car. <clears throat> Wait a minute. Am I right, Neville? Shall I bring the whiskey, old sport? I mean, the, the apple juice. That sounds like an excellent idea. You know? the great Gatsby out of the cars, both curious and dreadful what might happen next. You see, watching Gatsby's life is like watching a diamond studded 24 karat gold freight train careen down the rails. You know Newton, I'm telling you, if I see that Daisy is being untrue to me, I'll have that slobber dodger skinned alive, you know? And as for her, oh hey, there's my lady. Hey, Myrtle! Myrtle! I'll talk to you real soon. I, uh, I gotta deal something with the missus first. Yeah, dog. Okay, I'll see you later. I love you. As I was saying, Nelson, that slobber dodger, he's got some big kahunis to be messing with my wife, is there? far above being entertained by this petty drama, but isn't this just juicy? Yes. A row. It's a noun. It means an equinous quarrel. Oh, okay, old sport. I have no idea what you're talking about in the slightest. He isn't cousin a row, Tom. You are. Have some self-control. Me have self-control? I not the one having an affair with this ninny hammer, near do well, nobody. Oh, well what do you make of this ordeal with that Myrtle woman? What about it? Well, that's beside the fact, old sport. She never loved you anyway. Tell it! Well, 
See, she never loved you truly, old sport. No, not even at Kipalunkalani. I mean, I wouldn't go. I need some tea. Don't you go manipulating her, old sport. You say old sport one more time, and you're not gonna like it. You caddy want this gizzard. Tom, I, don't Tom. you know what he does, Daisy? I hired a private investigator, and it turns out he is a bona fide bootlegger. It's not surprising. This miscreant, he couldn't earn a fortune any other way. <laughs> Let's go, Tom. Okay. Wait. You're right with Gatsby. I want you to rub this into his face. Come on, Nikolai. Well, it was pretty close that time. I don't know about you, but that whole ordeal was quite the show. My spiny senses have never tingled so hard before. If I was a judgmental man, I would say that all three of them need to get a grip on their lives and realize just how pointless they are. Just, just, I'm the only one amongst this group that has their head screwed on straight. <laughs>